Hello, friends. Happy Monday. As you hop on, say hey. Let us know that you're here. It is snarky night. If you're catching this part, you're probably catching the replay. Make sure to comment hashtag replay. Let us know that you were here and that you saw this. And I'm going to go ahead and try to get this little bit of work stuff done. It's snarky night. We shouldn't have to work anymore. Snark, snark, snarky night. Snarky night. You guys, we have been like excited for snarky night for weeks now, I think. Like trying to find a time to do it and all that jazz. So um, we are super excited for this. I hope that you are all ready for tonight's snarky night. But say, hey, we have some really fun goodies for you. So we have some fun um, backwards. We flipped the screen so that you guys would be able to read all of our fun snarky goodies. And so it's like super weird. We're moving the opposite direction. Hello. Yes, it's snarky night, snarky night. Um, <laughs> you're wondering about this one. I know, you know, we figured there are a few things tonight that might not appeal to everybody. So we didn't want to throw it in on a regular day. And we have enough goodies that we were like, let's just do, it's our own night, our own snarky night. So grab your beverage. I know it's Monday night, but it's okay, right? To have a, have a beverage on a Monday night. They better be because we are. <laughs> we are. We actually have our cooler in here. Oh, yeah. We, we look really out. classy. We, 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 have we have our Coleman. We, we have, have our Coleman cooler in. here for Snarky Night. We're ready. It's Snarky. We're getting it snarky. It is Snarky. Um, okay. So, let me get this shared. And you guys, tonight's going to be like normal. We're going to go over all the new goodies. And then you'll be able to shop our very own a Snarky category um, that is going to be on the website and on the app. You guys, I've added a new featured collection spot on the website where you guys will be able to find this easily. Um, all the goodies that are releasing tonight. So make sure to check for that when you are on the site. So you'll look under featured collections and then Snarky Night to find tonight's stuff. Um, so it's hopefully it'll be easy. You know, we always try to make it easy and then sometimes things just are complicated. Um, sometimes things are complicated and we're not doing complicated on snarky night. No, no tonight's fun, fun night. night. Yeah. So, um, Christine was getting more and more snarky today, um, throughout shipping because we had two over 200 orders from this weekend. Thank you guys. Um, but yeah, we had a ton of orders and so the more orders she pulled, the more snarky she was getting. So we were like, this is perfect for tonight's live. It's really, it's really the jewelry and uh, the heat up here that made me snarky. <laughs> they were just overwhelming. So yeah, she was definitely in snarky mode and we were just laughing. We're I like, told her I was...
Well, I hope y'all had a wonderful weekend. Um, and like I said, we've done a ton of shipping for Christmas in July. We tried to combine orders as we could, but just a heads up, obviously when we have this many orders or sales, we don't usually put, um, we can't handwrite notes for everybody. We love you all, know we love you uh, regardless, but we don't do handwritten notes in all of those sale packs or um, sale orders. So we put in an extra couple business cards. So if you guys think of it, throw them in your wallet, don't throw them out, throw them in your wallet and then that way you can pass them out to your friends and you can tell them about the referral program and that if you give them your link, you have to share your link uh, because this is a, a work for you to be able to get $10 off and for them to get $10 off. Um, so you give them your link and then they'll be able to get 10 bucks off and so will you if they shop. So make sure to tell them about that, but pass out those business cards so that way um, you all get a little extra savings. So, okay, I think... I am probably good here, Christine. Okay. So tonight comments are going to be just a wee bit different because we're covering just some snarky goodies and um, we're not going to be doing all of our whole outfit changes and that kind of thing. So um, we're just going to have some short little comments for you guys to follow along with. And actually, I'm just starting this live out. And then Christine, the like queen of snarky, she's going to come out here uh, to do the rest of this live. But hello, you guys. Welcome, welcome. Um, so I'm starting out in this shirt because it was more fitting since I'm a parent. Um, and yes, this is, I actually snatched one up for myself as soon as they came in about a month ago. Um, and I love how subtle it is that it, and it's so funny because I was telling Christine I wore it this weekend. We had a baseball tournament and this old gentleman got on the elevator with me who you could tell was a very poised man and he got on and he read my shirt and he was like, I needed that about 45 years ago. And I was like, because it's so true for all of us parents. I love my ungrateful children. Um, and it's just so subtle. So it's like the perfect tea. Now, um, this one is, I believe, a Bella Canvas tea. We'll try to cover all of that for you. It does appear to be a Bella Canvas. I though, I sized up to a medium in this just for a little bit more comfortable fit. You guys usually see see me in a small um but I just I liked the little bit of extra room so in this one I opted to go up to the medium and I love this grayish blue background and I, I love the saying we're backwards today we switched the camera so every way I move we'll see maybe Christina will do better than I do but I I'm know, all like awkward to, well where am I moving where am I looking yeah. so yeah this one will be available today on snarky night to start it off I love my ungrateful children it is just the absolutely perfect um because I think any parent can relate and understand understand that same feeling and I of course just need to show you my Judy Blue jeans that are one of my favorites these are a new restock of the boyfriend fit right destroyed boyfriend feet we don't even have the details written down for these because even why know. would we it's why would we it's night. Night. Snack but anyway so okay I'm gonna go I'm taking a hold of the that computer and Christine's coming out here so um thank you for joining us for snarky night if you're new little rundown um we are just going to cover all the goodies we're releasing tonight and immediately following the live we will post them to the site and the app where there you guys can shop so just sit back relax have a cold beverage crack open a beer or whatever it is that you like to drink I mean it should be like bush light or um like keystone light the on snarky night end. yeah the high end look I can't even the like move end. my hair the right way because I'm like backwards so Ooh, yeah here show this one oh this oh is this, this is also a really good one so I we're actually gonna have some fun cups today too which is new for us um to be releasing this is one of my favorites that I for sure need I did not snatch one of these up yet and I don't know why but I love it because it says good oh good mom bad habits so it's just this really super cute it's like that old school style when were these like out like eight, late 80s i think is when this like mug kind of came out these yeah, big I think mom probably still had yes our mom had one that she chugged water out of but i mean i would probably chug something other than water out of this good mom with bad habits cup so just super cute a big cup well it comes with the straw um and i don't this is 22 ounces so it's 22 a good ounces. size mug yes. um but yeah I would think that we need to probably drink something with bad habits that involve bad habits oh, out of yeah. this one. So this is releasing tonight as well. I'm going to snatch it up and wear it with my shirt so that everybody can see um, how can the straw be cut. Yeah, I would say it's one of those just like classic old school style straws that you can for sure cut. It's, it's probably from the 1980s. <laughs> found them in a warehouse it's from the 1980s. So everything comes back around. So we're just going to start a warehouse of saving things that in 20 years we can resell right mm -hmm. yeah so okay good mom bad habits 
And yeah, I think that covers that. So Christine's gonna come on out here. I'm gonna that. take her seat and see how I do oh, over here. Oh my goodness. Y'all, I got voted as the snarky sister. Oh, she is right. It is different. You gotta figure it out. So I don't know where my mama is. I don't know if you're watching tonight. I haven't seen you, but get ready for some earmuffs because I there might be there might be one or two swear words. All right, okay, hold on. Before to I get into this, nice clean. yeah, we keep it clean, but we like a little snark. Um, anybody new here? Rachel's typically a small. I'm typically an extra large, so I'm going to show you everything in an extra large tonight. If you want to see it in a large, this is snarky night. That's not happening. Thank you for asking. Come back tomorrow. <laughs> we'll try it then. Um, so <laughs> let me just. Hold on, let me just, let me just take a second. <laughs> We're like totally anti-drinking in public during our lives and we try to keep it really professional, but we do like a little snark. Did you guys drink before the live? We opened one right before the live. So we'll see the progression of what happens over the course of the next little bit and if we can handle our booze you on camera. You guys will know because that cooler is right there. So. Yeah, you'll see every time we need a new one. So this one is booze, the super glue holding this shit show together. It's true, right? I mean, if you have a family, if you have a farm, if you have a business, you know <laughs> that you weekend warriors, you're living for this. So if you like booze like we do, this shirt is for you. While I'm out here, oh my goodness, I feel like this is a must to match this. Let me see. Hold on, hold on. Which way am I going? So Oop, I'm a little close. Wine goes in wisdom comes out. I mean, how much better does it get than a boozy shirt and a boozy wine tumbler <laughs> that you can wear together? I don't know what your booze of choice is. I've seen some scroll across the screen, Trulies, Twisted Tea. So this one might not be for you, but I promise you that we have one. So super glue, if you need any super glue to hold your shit show and together. And super fun gifts too. This is true. They do make fun gifts. If you have a snarky friend, then this is the gift that they need. Um, Rachel just decided that I was the snarkier of the two sisters. So you're going to see me the majority of the time Other out people here. Are agreeing though. That I'm the snarkier one? Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. It doesn't offend me. I don't mind being snarky. Let me go get you another shirt, ladies. Okay, ooh, I think I'll do this one next. I'll do this one next. Are you gonna hang up my shirts for me? Oh no, you can oh. hang them up after, just like I always do. <laughs> Not <laughs> happening. Yeah, tonight's live is fun. We've been gathering these little goodies for a few weeks and- oh, this smells so good. I know, those Where already smell good. my hat? Do I wanna save this one? Sure. I'll save that one for the end. Okay, but this. <laughs> <laughs> what if it, quick changes right I'm not changing my pants so it's just the shirt change all right I've got friends in low places and then it lists off Chardonnay Merlot Rosé Cabernet I can't read it um oh yeah I'm fixing the wrong side of my hair it's this so is weird. so weird Christine said she was gonna believe herself mm. <laughs> <laughs> Screwed that up the first go around. Lisa said she loves that you're whispering, Mom. Oh, yeah. And then, <laughs> let's get drunk and judge people. Listen, <laughs> if there were a saying for my life, I'm just gonna laugh this the is the one. Like, if I could just, I'm just going to get drunk and I'm just going to sit back and I'm going to scroll through your news feed and judge away. And I'm going to watch you in public and I'm going to judge away. So. Because yeah. these are all the, a, lot, a lot of these teas are like the things that we think, but we don't say out loud. Yes. These are all, so which one, which one is a really good, oh, here's another good one. This is a good one. They're not all necessarily, oh, I'm going the wrong way. Go ahead. Sit back. Judge me. I can't figure out the camera. <laughs> it's cool. Whatever. Um, it's not drinking alone if the dog is home. So, I mean, why, I can't even turn it the right way. You'll need somebody new to do this because I don't even know what I'm doing. So if you have a dog or you like wine or you like to just sit back and drink and judge people, I feel like this is the combo for you. And fun fact, they match. So you can wear your I Got Friends in Low Places tea and uh, sit back and judge people. 
So are these all Bella Canvas? Rachel, you might have to help with this. Because, listen, yeah. I'm not good at the fabric thingy. I'm in an extra large. Um, but I feel like it's snarky night, so do I have to be good at everything? Just out of curiosity. But normal fit, really fun, bleach splattering all over it, burgundy color. Um, what else am I missing? I don't know. Um, that one too, and it smells really good. It so smells there's nothing so like a good. Snarky shirt that smells so good. This is the brand that if you guys have gotten any of like our bleach teas that you open it and mm -hmm. you're like, oh my gosh, this smells so good. This one is it. This and is like, it. I would buy it just because it smells good. This is it. This is it true. It's cute. I love unboxing their stuff because it smells so good. <laughs> Kelly, so good. The t-shirt smells good. Whatever they use, because anything that's bleached is comes pre-washed. And so they, like, in person, they're bleached them and then wash them. And we've even tried to get them to tell us what they use to wash their clothes, because it smells so good. I do. I email them. I don't want you to see my shirt yet. <laughs> I'm going to email them again, <laughs> now that it's been some time, and see if they'll tell us. Yeah, so I email them all the time because I really love the smell of their fabric, but they will not tell me what they... Nobody tells you. Oh, God. It's so backwards. Where are my single girls at? Because... Or, I don't know, maybe if you're getting divorced, you want to wear this to court one day. <laughs> Good taste court. in music. <laughs> Bad taste in men. It says it all. How cute is this? is a Bella Canvas. I looked at it before I put it on. But how fun is, like, the neon vibe? It looks like you're going to Nashville. So maybe you don't want to wear it to court. Maybe you just want to wear it to Nashville. No big deal. You don't have to wear it to court. But, I don't know, the judge might... You know, if you're not allowed to speak in court, this could be perfect to, you know, just tell the judge what you really think without saying anything. So good taste in music, bad taste in men. Again, I am in an extra large and this one is a Bella Canvas. I looked. I looked. Yeah, it's I so cute. It I love how it looks like neon lights. Yes, it's so fun. It's like you're right in Nashville. I mean, this would be a fun one to wear to Nashville or to a music city or wherever because it's got that neon light vibe. And it's funny. How many people are going to step up? Maybe you'll find a good man wearing the shirt walking down the road. He understands that you have bad taste in men and he just wants to fix all of that for you. He's going to be your Prince Charming. You know what? And you guys, like, could I'm happen. really feeling here because I didn't, that's the first comment I put about what you're wearing or talking about. She's not very good. No, I'm not very She's good. She's not very good job. at this. She's not very good. Um, which one do I want to, oh, um, we'll do this one. Okay, so on top of all of the fun mugs and t-shirts and everything that's going to come tonight, we are launching cosmetic bags and they are just as fun as the shirts. So this one says, absolutely did not wake up like this. <laughs> If you need a cute little cosmetic bag, I think these are $16, so really good price point. They're nine and a quarter inches by six something. Ask a man. He'll tell you it's a foot. I don't even know. Doesn't matter, but it will fit your basic essentials for makeup so that you don't have to wake up and go out in public like this. So cute shirts, Bella Canvas tee. Absolutely did not wake up like this cosmetic bag. Am I going too fast? I feel like I'm going too fast. No. Oh, how about I do these next? How about I do these? Oh, God. The highly anticipated grassies. They are here, y'all. We have been waiting excitedly to launch these. So Rachel, Ian, and I have a pair, and we wear them everywhere. And people, I know, like, at first we made fun of them. We did, excuse me, too much truly. Oh, my goodness. We, <laughs> we thought they were ridiculous. These are so fun, y'all. The It's basically, like, AstroTurf on the bottom. I think what my favorite part is, let me see if I can get close. Hold on, which direction do I go? You can see, like, the little brown, like, dead grass in there. Don't worry, you don't have to water or mow them. There's none of that that you have to do. They come already. They're not gonna grow on you. You don't have to worry about trimming them. They'll stay perfect. It's like walking around on grass, but you don't have to worry about, you know, like the dog poop on the bottom of your foot that you're gonna step in because you're gonna have a shoe on. Uh, Rachel's son, Blake, begged her 
for a pair. So fun fact, he lost them this weekend in the grass on a hill. Don't take them off in the grass. You will lose them. They blend right in. So we have them in men's sizes and women's. Um, the women's are, mine are a little worn because I, well, I wear them everywhere. Um, women's are white and hot pink. gift um and we're or even a gag gift but they're comfortable so it's like a gag gift that will be used kind of a thing we had some customers saying like oh my husband needs those um to wear like to the shower camping and you know all kinds of fun stuff so i think that everybody will love 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 them okay all right ladies if you're easily offended, this is the time to exit. <laughs> but if you're not, stick around, because it's about to get real. Um, <laughs> sometimes you just can't say everything out loud, so you can let your shirt do it for you. This shirt is ugly, just like your face. Sorry, sometimes people have to say it. Is this a Bella canvas? I don't even know. This is, I can feel the tag. This is a Bella canvas. So... I am in my true size, extra large, but this is, I don't know, this is a funny one. I don't care where you go. If you think bad taste in men is a conversation starter, I feel like this shirt is going to be the conversation starter. It is not a cute shirt. You are not, listen, we normally sell you cute shirts. Tonight is not the night. Well, at least not in this case. This shirt is ugly. I mean, they couldn't have picked more putrid colors for it, but... It's funny. And the cool thing about these, let me just say this with something like this. These are unisex fit. My husband would totally wear this if his beard didn't get in the way. So maybe your husband will wear it because they are funny. And then, oh God, oh my God. I'm gonna, okay, get ready for the bleeps. Do I just have to, can I like, can I put a finger in front of it? That one's 26, right that shirt? Did you fall from heaven? Because your face is bleeped up. <laughs> bleeped up. I can't even. So you're going to get the shirt. Get the matching on. Normally you hear about the fell from heaven. You must be an angel. Nope. You hit the concrete way too hard. That's it. So, I mean, you can just sit there in your shirt, drinking your coffee telling the world what you think about them. <laughs> oh my God. All right, let me find another. Um, oh boy, which one do I want to Snarky do? Snarky like never before seen. 
I know. <laughs> we, we don't need that bug ever. I know. They'll all be available at the end of this live. Don't you worry. Um... Hold on, do I need to, do I need, I don't know, what, like, what are the Facebook rules? What are you allowed to say? There's not enough sage in the world for this shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, 2020 to 2021, you know that's right. I don't know, I don't even know, maybe I should have grown sage in my garden. I don't know if that would have worked um, to fix anything that's going on right now, but if you like crystals and sage and incense and spraying the world down with all that good vibe positivity, you know there's not enough sage. So maybe you wanna start covering this. You know what, I think I should just wear this hat. I'm just gonna wear this hat because I feel like this is where we're going. Let's get toasted, y'all. All right, so this is another one of our trucker caps. Yo, she was me during the live. Excuse her. Well, I get a Excuse her. I think our audience is watching. They're really confused about what we're doing on a, uh, on a Monday. Monday night. We're never here peering into their apartments on Monday. So this is a cute trucker cap. Um, you get camo, like the mesh back is camo. Man, wrong direction. I swear. I've had like half of a truly. I just can't figure out this reverse reverse camera so you get that fun mesh hat um and then it's got camouflage on the back this is a perfect one for how many of you camp i mean if you go camping a lot with the little s'mores on top of it let's get toasted my husband will wear this just in the backyard because he wants to burn everything down <laughs> all of the time um he's a pyro he oh rachel fell in the fire at our house sorry sorry as i get close because i gotta reach to the table for my drink <laughs> Rachel fell in the fire at our house one time. She had third degree burns on her hands and had to go to the ER. Um, but Ian felt really guilty, mainly because it was his fault that the fire was so big that Rachel fell into it. Um, but after that, she just decided to tell everybody that he pushed her in. <laughs> Whatever. She didn't put she didn't press charges, so it's fine. Nothing bad happened. Her hands healed up. You can't even tell she fell in fire. No big deal. Um so NBD. Right, NBD. That sage mug is my life. Yeah. So if y'all like fires, if you want to come have a fire with us, if you like camping and drinking at a campfire, the let's get toasted hat is certainly for you. And if you think that people have ugly faces, this shirt is for you. <laughs> that sage mug is my life. Oh, my God. Yeah, it is. It is. It's so good. Yes. I mean, everybody is like, just a little, like the sage. It'll be fun. Yeah. Sage, spray crystals, spray whatever you need. It, sage on it. Yeah. Whatever you need. Okay. Let me, shirt time? I New shirt time. Hat, New shirt yeah. time. New shirt time. New shirt time. New shirt time. I think I need to do a couple mugs and ooh and some makeup bags. Yeah, Holly said she remembers when I saw the fire. I know it was just like two years ago, in a couple weeks, two yeah. years ago. Labor Day. That happened. Labor Day. Ooh, is this another good smell? <laughs> what? Stephanie, that this live is confirming we'd be really good friends in real life. <laughs> Christine looks good in hats. She does. It makes me jealous. Oh, thanks. I love them. Um. <laughs> okay, what I does this one say? I do too. I'm such a hot pink girl. This one also smells really good. So if you're buying Ooh. based off smell, this one is This one is one. for you. This is for you. If you like how things smell. I mean, the thing is, though, is that, like, just open the package and sniff. Don't ever wear it because you're going to wash the scent away as soon as you're done with it. So this one, again, I'm in an extra large and everything tonight, y'all. Responsibility is calling, and I must ignore it. Who do they have to call in tomorrow? I'm just going to let Rachel know that I must ignore I my responsibility. Oh. Unless I have too many white claws. Oh, in which case she'll come in here and screw up shipping your packages. Perfect. <laughs> That's what we like to do. Yes. So if you just want something a little less snarky, you know, where you're not calling people out for their ugly faces, this would be an accurate shirt that like you just don't feel like adulting anymore. 2020 to 2021, gotcha. And you're done and you don't feel like doing it. 
then this is the shirt for you. But super fun, bright hot pink with bleach splatter all over it. Again, every shirt that I have on tonight is an extra large, so responsibility is calling. I must ignore it. Let's see what other mugs we have. <laughs> I love that shirt too. I love having just some fun graphic tees that are generic. I end up seeing in my closet and I'm like, well, this is holiday specific, holiday specific. I love having generic ones that I can wear all the time. I know, I need all these sheets, shirts too. Sheets too. Two sheets to the wind over here. Okay, all right. Raise your hands if you work from home. Just kidding, I can't see your hands. Um, this mug is for you though. It says, me, this show is boring. Boss, again, this is a Zoom conference. <laughs> I can't even imagine. I don't I don't even I don't even know. I don't know what working from home would be like for the last couple of years or how you would sit there, but you know, if you just wanna you know this is another perfect one. You don't even have to say anything. Just hold this mug up and take a couple sips during your meeting. Any of you <laughs> teachers, teachers out there, this would be perfect, especially if you're like kindergarten and they don't know how to read. They would have no idea that you think those 28 little kiddos are boring. What does my tattoo on my arm mean? Uh, this is my wedding anniversary. Hold on, from left to right. <laughs> 5, 13, 2017. My husband has a matching one, just not so feminine. His is a little more masculine, um, but it's our anniversary. We went and got matching tattoos right after we got married, so. Yeah, I feel like um, this is also be a really good gift to like get your boss that you oh. have some meetings with. <laughs> yes, especially one that doesn't have a sense of humor. I'm sure he would appreciate it. <laughs> that would be good. Uh, and while you're buying your boss gifts, maybe they would appreciate the dear autocorrect. Never have I ever meant ducking. <laughs> I have never meant ducking. I own ducks. And I have never meant ducking in my life. Mom, are you on here? I'm sorry, but I've never meant ducking. Um, so just another fun travel mug. You know, how many times does autocorrect get us? I was telling Rachel, my autocorrect just decided that every time I want to type the word and, it's sending the word abs. I don't have abs. I don't want abs. I've never worked on abs. I just want a conjunction in my <laughs> sentence. Please send the word and. Or not ducking. That'll work too. And I hate when it tells me that I'm a shot show. I am not a shot show. <laughs> Not a shot you show. The, you are the glue holding this shot show together. Yes, that's what it should have said. I'm the glue holding this shot show together. What can I say? All right. Uh, I'll save a couple mugs. I'll be back with something else. Yeah, ducking. That's my, that's the best one. <laughs> All right. This is by far the greatest. Oh, this one. You know, maybe you should um, shotgun a be, uh, truly right now. Do you want me to, like, puke on camera? <laughs> it is snarky night. It is snarky night. Okay, I'll take a drink. Let me come back up slow. Let me come back up. Let me just get all up in here. Hmm. Hmm. I can't fix my hair when I don't know what way it goes. I have, I have a fuzz in there, but it's so backwards. I can't even figure it out. <laughs> My husband's name is Dirk, and I autocorrect it to Dork or Duck. <gasps> See, you need the ducking. Never have I met ducking. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay, if there was ever a shirt that was made for me. <laughs> Ladies, show me your RBF. Yeah, bust it out. You know you want to. You know you are angry glaring at the phone right now. Because... If my mouth doesn't say it, my face certainly will. <laughs> Usually my mouth says it, but just in the in the off chance <laughs> that, that I that I off. actually hold it in, that almost never happens. Listen, I this is a true story. <sighs> Up until now, I have only quit one job. Because my mouth has gotten me fired from every <laughs> other job. <laughs> This is true, I'll admit it, I know, I know my faults. I know my flaws and mine happen to be my mouth. Sometimes my face, I can't, I mean, it just is what it is. So one way or another, you are going to know exactly 
how I feel. And I think that there are some of you out there like that as well. And if you're one of those people, then you need this shirt. And on the off chance that I can hold my face and my mouth both in, my shirt will let you know that I, oh, where's my judging hat? That I am sitting back and drinking and I am judging you. I am doing a really terrible job with comments, you guys. She's just drinking too much back there. She can't handle it. Like, she doesn't even have to like talk about this thought. She just has to drop the comment and I already did the comment. I know, I am, but I'm like really failing at this. Failing, okay, what do we have over here? What do we have over here? Mm. More makeup bags. Oh, you guys, these are so fun. Beauty comes from within this bag. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just like the other one is absolutely did not wake up like this. That's a fact. Did not wake up like this. This is like four layers of makeup. 7 a.m., 3 p.m., 6, and then another one at like 8, 11 when we realized we had to be out here in 19 minutes. So, yeah, absolutely did not wake up like this. Beauty comes from within this bag. And then, oh, oh just like a shirt that was made for me. This bag was made for me. Maybe makeup, could be snacks. Definitely <laughs> snacks. If you have any idea, I carry a backpack every day. How many little bags I have in there of all different things. I definitely think that I need that. Might be makeup, could be snacks in my backpack with some snacks in it. So fun cosmetic bags coming out tonight and, and i think little gifts you guys this is true these, all of these are good gifts yeah and they're even like good gifts to have on hand because like we all know we have those snarky friends that every now and again you just need a gift to give them or like those wine tumblers are really good um or how many times have you forgotten a birthday? Yeah. And so, you're scrounging around. Yeah, they're fun. But I think, like, me and all of my friends, like, all my baseball friend moms, all need this good mom with bad habits mug. Like, for sure. We would all be rocking it on the baseball field, drinking out of this. I don't know if I'm going to offend you guys, but, like, you're, like, really pretty. <laughs> Maybe. It's a snarky night. Maybe I'm lying. What does my face tell you? I don't know, because I'm not in the camera. <laughs> so this is the other makeup bag launching tonight. No, oh, I can't get the right direction. You're like really pretty. I feel like a mean girl every time I read it. You can't sit with us. Yeah. And you, you can't, can't sit say with it us. like not sarcastically. No. You're like really pretty, and you can't sit with us. Hmm. Mm -mm. Nope. Christine adding her own like dot 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 comments on these things. Okay, so this was Ian's favorite shirt. So I saved this because he really wants our your mom called. She said you left your game at home. And I love this. This one's funny. Your mom this called. One, your mom called. She said you left your game at home. Uh crew neck and v-neck in this one. Isn't yes, that in a mix? They, they showed up in a mix. So, so not all sizes are available in all V-neck or all crew neck, but there's a mix of them. Yeah. So like if you have the cool 16 year old, get this and wear it around his friends. <laughs> <laughs> your mom or, called. You left to yeah, get home. You know, you wear that to your um, son's baseball or football game. This is true too. Really? You know what? I would wear it to my nephews. <laughs> really insult and then him. And go out there and like talk to the other team. I would. I actually tell him to run laps. I'm a, I'm, mm, we won't, we won't, we won't go down the sport line because I'm very competitive. What was it the other day she told him that he had to hit a home run? Oh yeah, we were getting ready to come back on uh, Wednesday. We had worked Wednesday during the day and then left for like dinner time. We eat dinner out at the ball field on Wednesdays. And we were out there and it was time for us to come back to get ready for the live. And I was like, Luke, Luke, come here, come here. Mommy and I have to leave. So he hit me a home run or I'm not coming back. <laughs> Turns out the pitcher wasn't that great. So he got walked to first. And then from first, first base, he was yelling, Kiki, I didn't hit you a home run. I guess you're not coming back. I'll go back, but they better have a better pitcher and he better hit me a home run. Just saying. 
Oh, you love this mug? I didn't even read it to you yet. I just rescued some wine. It was trapped in a bottle. So, you know, there are a lot of different wine tumblers tonight that you can use, you know, in the conjunction with that. I've got friends in low places, a lot of fun, different wine sayings. Um, like Rachel said, great for gifts. <laughs> I just looked at what else I have to show you. <laughs> oh, I was like, what else do you have? I am dying. If you guys end up liking Snarky Night, we'll have to do this on a regular basis. <gasps> yes, please let me. Yeah, so if this please. goes over well and we like Snarky Night, I mean, we can maybe get a little more snarky. I don't but we more. worried about, like... Who are we going to find? Leave your opinions at... Leave your opinions at the door and bring your sense of humor with you. <laughs> okay. The last shirt was made for me. This mug. I'm okay, listen. My husband has looked this up, and apparently I have a disorder. Because I don't like listening to your slurpy mouth noises. <laughs> if I can hear you chew, I have fantasized about your death. This is true. I have told Oh, I have politely asked people at restaurants to stop chewing with their mouth open. <laughs> I'm sure it was polite. They might have started a fight one time. I can't, you know what? I, you're not a cow. Stop showing me your cud. <laughs> Chew with your mouth closed. Nobody wants to see that up in there. If you are chewing with your mouth open, I swear I have come up with 47 different ways to take you out. You know what my mom's favorite way is? An icicle because your murder weapon melts. Keeping that in the arsenal. <laughs> Never going to forget that one. <clears throat> but yeah, we have to, whenever we have meals, we have to have music playing. I can't even, I can't even. <laughs> Rachel's son will talk with his mouth full of food. And I literally, I won't even look in his direction. I will just say, I can't hear you through the mouth full of food. <laughs> We're working on it, okay? I can't We're understand sick. you. We're working on it. I can't understand you with that food in the way. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Clean the corners. Yeah, a little white gobbledygook out of there. Chew with your mouth closed. Yes. Okay. Is that? I think this is it. I think <laughs> I think this is it. So before we go tonight, we just want to remind you that drunk wives matter. Because <laughs> we're about to be and our husbands are going to have to come pick us up. <laughs> I think that's it. Did I miss anything? Did I go too fast? <laughs> I'm backwards on camera. My cheeks are so red from laughing and the heat. But you guys, these are all great t-shirts, great for gifts. Remember some of them. They're all unisex. So husbands can wear any of these. Brothers, brother-in-laws, whoever. These are great for gifts. They're funny. Wine mugs. Obviously, some of them have some floral details to it. So, you know, those are going to be for the girls in your life or whatever. Um, but the rest of them will make really good gifts. Don't forget the makeup bags and then the grassies. The grassies are going to be available. There is a size guide there. I'm going to tell you this. I know it's American. We use inches. Find a rule of centimeters. The centimeter <laughs> measurement is accurate. We are the only people refusing to go to the metric system. Get your ruler with centimeters out. Measure your foot. That is going <laughs> to get you the best foot on your grassy. Or you know what? Go up a size. You'll have like three inches of grass around your foot. Either way, doesn't matter. They're going to fit and you're going to be walking on grass. They're, they're heavenly, you guys. They're they are. They're so good. They are. I love them. I wear them everywhere. I'm sit back and let drunk wives matter. <laughs> oh, you guys. I hope you have a wonderful night. Thanks for joining us on a Monday. And we'll see you in 48 hours. Bye. Thank you, guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.